Hello LTA musicians, this is Mrs. Peterson. You might be wondering why I might have Uno and what looks to be a scorecard over here. Uh, we're gonna play a rhythm game in just a minute, but not yet. And we're also going, in this lesson, we're also going to be um, doing a rhythm play along. Have fun with that one. It's gonna be a lot of fun. And then also I wanna share with you a fun percussion video of a group called Stomp. They get to um, perform and make music and it's a lot of fun. They use objects that you might not think are percussion instruments, but they use them and they make wonderful rhythms and beats out of them. And it, their shows are a lot of fun as well. Okay, here we go. So as I'm playing my rhythm game, you can use Uno cards or you can use uh, regular playing cards, whatever you might have at your house. Okay, something like this. Or you can also make your own. You can cut up a piece of paper, get permission from your parents, cut up a piece of paper, and then you can make your own cards. All right, here we go. So this is how this is gonna work. I have some fun colored pens over here that I wanna use. I'm gonna use uh, purple, my favorite color, of course. And I have green, and then I also have a blue highlighter because at the end I want to highlight some of my favorite rhythms. All right, we'll see. So when I flip over a card, it says three. So I need to go ahead and make three measures. Let me use my pen here. I need to make three rhythms. I'm going to have my bar lines, and I'm going to have that it's in 4 4 timing. Maybe that might change later in the game. Okay, one two, three, four. And you get to compose your own rhythms. Ti ti ta, ti ti ta. Now this game you could play on your own or you could play with a partner and alternate turns. Do I have one more to do? Let's see, ti ti. Shh. T, T. Shh. Alright, I did one, two, three. So if I'm playing with somebody else, that means reverse, and it's going to be their turn. So if I'm only playing on my own, then I'm going to say this rhythm, and then I'm going to say it backwards in reverse order. So let's say it. One, two, ready, say it. Ta, 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 ta. T, T, ta. T T ta T T sh T T sh now backwards reverse one two ready go T T sh T T sh T T ta T T ta 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 you're done so if you have two people you can alternate who goes I'm playing on my own so I'm gonna go ahead and go again Oh, now I have to make four rhythms. Yay. Three. Ooh, my paper's getting pretty full. So you might want to use a bigger piece of paper than Mrs. Peterson. Let's see. Ta. Sh. Ta. Ooh, ta ah. That would be two beats. Well, shh. Ta. Ta. And. Shh. Ta. Ti ti ta. Okay. So as I go through, then I'm going to have to add two more rhythms maybe the other person would have to add two rhythms to yours okay you can have fun with this and make up your some of your own rules as well some house rules okay that card would mean reverse that means it's the other person's turn or in reverse order like i just did oh no your turn is skipped you get a little break a little rest add three add three more rhythms so if you have two people maybe you could add to your other person's card so they could switch 
and you can switch papers and you have to add three rhythms to their composition. I think that would be pretty fun. Two, reverse, you get the idea, okay? So I added a bunch of cards in here and I might play this against my family later today. We'll see. Have fun, have lots of fun with this rhythm game and tell me how you play. All right, I'll catch you later.